Uh, we gotta get these ice arrows out so we can go ahead and do some chilling here in the schoolyard. This is not the schoolyard, it turns out. Alright, so we gotta shoot ourselves some Octo Rocks. Unfortunately, uh, they are jerks and uh, truly no one likes them, but you know, it's fine. Gotta make our way over here. Once you're over here, you should be able to reach some trees across the way. It's very important. You totally cannot just aim for this tree from the other side of the canyon. Totally you can't. You just can't. It won't happen. You can't t possibly just barely reach it from a specific angle. Not at all. Here's an owl statue. <laughs> Finally, we get a warp in this place. I don't know why it's like so far in. I mean, I kind of get it, but I also kind of don't. So this is our next location of interest. I don't know what that was, but it was kind of cool, I guess. There's this cool like castle door going on over here. Front gate. All right, cool. I accidentally pulled out my ocarina. I don't know how that happened, but there's a little passageway over here. What could this lead to? Big ol' sunblock? Crystal switch? I can't use my sword right now, but it's okay. I got a hookshot. <laughs> that, uh, didn't help me at all. So we're gonna pretend like nothing even happened in there because nothing even happened in there. Uh, there is another spot where I could have gotten a Garo to appear, but it didn't happen. There's just mummies around? That's not concerning. Keep away from our, keep away from our house. My father is not one of you. Well, it seems like this, this mummy man over there has a disagreeance with you. If I'm being honest, if I remember right, I think this is the the fairy fountain. All right, well, I could cure my quarter heart disease, but I think I'll be all right. I think I will live. It is entirely possible. So up here, I believe that's where I ultimately want to go, and I don't want to go there yet, so I'm not gonna. Turns out... And there's just a lot of uh, ninja hints around here. Spring water cave, entry prohibited due to ghost sightings. Whoa, that sounds rad. I want in on this. Oh man, this looks, uh, this, this looks, looks pretty good. Look, look at this place. It's, it's got that creepy vibe going. What business do you have in Akana Kingdom, land where only the dead roam? Well, I'm here, and I'm still alive. Those Octoroks were still alive. That Deku Scrub was still alive. This is no place for one as full of life as you. Or do you say you wish to join the dead? That is fine. If that is the case, then sleep gently to the melody of darkness that I, the great composer Sharp, shall play. And join the ranks of the dead. Listen, I'm not gonna lie. Um, this song is killing me. So I'm gonna play a better song. I can't believe that didn't work! <laughs> I'm upset! Fine, I'll play this song instead. What, what is this? No, it can't be this song! I keep telling you people to stop touching the fuzzies. It's a bad habit, man. 
Oh man, we got some water flow going on here. I love water wheels. Carnival music is a bit weird, but you know what? That's fine. I'm not gonna lie, I forgot about Tingle. Probably should have done something with Tingle. It's fine. They're, uh, they're having a nervous breakdown, because they, uh... Mummy's had a bad experience at Carnival one time. It was a bad day. Oh, oh, oh no. Those repressed memories, they're coming back! Oh no! Joyously writhing in remembrance agony. That's a thing, probably. I did it. I solved the puzzle. Nice hexagon. It clicked. Flat, my dear brother. Forgive your foolish brother who dreamt of the revival of the royal family. Ye who do not fear the dead. With my brother's song, you have broken the curse that was placed upon me. This is all thanks to you. Yeah, remember the, the graveyard ghost guy that gave us the song? Yeah, that guy. We dead shall not be lingering here in this land. It was all a trick of the masked one who had upset things. Freaking, what is the extent of this guy's power? I don't understand. How did he do all of this in like the few hours I was... I don't even know if it was hours. He did it within like minutes? How long was I falling? I don't know, man. It's all very confusing. If you truly do not fear the dead, I wish for you to go to the temple in this land and sever the root of the evil curse that torments us. Let's do that. I, the only one who knows the way to the temple, shall direct you to the king. The king is in the ruins of the Akana Castle, awaiting the coming of the one who will break the curse. If you say so. I've made my final request. Okay, bye! Well, this place kind of lost its creepy vibe now that it's, uh... Not death-inducing, but you know what? We can't always be winners. Still kind of got that weird vibe out here, so you know what? That's pretty cool. There's a house over here. Spirit house. Actually, I think I know what this is, and I might want to stop in here real quick. Ghost hut! Hello, sir. Didn't we meet outside? Yeah, it's drenched in blood or whatever. That's gross, and, you know... I'm a child. I probably shouldn't be dealing with such things. A group of spirits plagued by lingering regrets. That sounds cool. Try saving these wandering spirits. Oh, but the earthly price must pay is 30 rupees. Yeah, okay, sure, whatever. Vigor? I have courage, not vigor. You got your Triforces wrong, guy. That's not even a Triforce. Now, if you drop below three hearts, it's a bad time. Don't do it. Here we go! So hey, remember in Ocarina of Time, the Poe sisters? This is basically that. <laughs> That's kind of all this. Well, technically speaking, I already fought the um, uh, the other one. My problem here, actually, did I? I have one Deku nut, and Deku nuts would actually be kind of ideal at this point. Um, not what I've pulled out, unfortunately. So you can kind of. Um, Get them to come out of hiding if you time everything correctly. A jump strike should be enough here. And then you have to fight two. It's a bad day. Unfortunately, I did a stab on accident. 
Um, I need you to spin again so I can jump attack. I want to jump attack you, but unfortunately I'm not, like, locked onto you properly. It makes me upset, actually. Yeah, if I had Deku Nuts... Well, I mean, it really wouldn't change too much, because the jump attack one-shots them anyway. Anyway, this phase is, you know, the same as Forest Temple. Uh, one of them spins, and you gotta shoot them. No, 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 no. I, I didn't know you could strafe in this game. Also, I have actually kind of lost which one it is at this point. Because the camera just does not want to cooperate with me in the slightest. It's like way too close. I feel like in Ocarina of Time, it zooms out a bit. Also, I could probably be using like fire arrows to do a little bit more damage, so... Let's go ahead and pull those out. I don't think you're on like a strict time limit here. All things considered, man, I am really good at this game, by the way. I don't know if you knew this. It's a well-kept secret in um, the world of the YouTubes or whatever. Uh, I'm pretty good at this game. It, I just, I, I spoiled it for you right here and now. Uh, it's one of you. But at present, I don't know which. I think they spin again eventually. Are you gonna spin again? Are you gonna... Thank you. Okay, I just... Oh. Really? Okay, I... See, I thought you would spin again, and I would therefore be able to... This zoomed-in camera is honestly ruining me. <laughs> oh, well, I could have used those arrows. Wow, I botched that horribly. Please give me a prize for my terrible efforts. Thank you, sir. Is your name correct? I can read people's hearts. Uh, I knew you'd be coming here. And now my own soul has been healed too. Uh, somehow. Hooray! <laughs> we did it together as a team. All right, well, now that I've done all of that shenanigans, let's go say hello to Tingle real quick like. Let's go say hello to Tingle, Mr. Like guy in tights who flies in the sky. Get the heck down here, person guy. I need a map. So badly do I need a map. Man, I sure love your spiel about forest fairies. I wish I were as lucky as you, Tingle. Give me a stone tower map. You could buy a clock town map for 40 rupees if you haven't yet, somehow. <laughs> I will not call you again, Tingle, because uh, you see, that was the last map I will ever need from you, so goodbye forever, I guess. I, I said goodbye forever, I guess. Gosh, Tingle, let me just roll off a cliff already, you dumb, stupid, dumb. All right. All of the mummies are gone, by the way, which means we can go over here and uh, do something. There's a small child out. I'm gonna... Uh, hello. Okay, goodbye, I guess. Ellipses. Man, if only I weren't so noticeable. Thank goodness I have the ability to just not be noticeable. I don't remember exactly how you trigger her coming back out of the house. I think you have to go far enough away, but I'm not 100% clear how far I have to go and if there's like an indication. The only other thing I can think of is if I actually like leave the area and come back. Uh-oh, the world's getting smaller again, guys. You gotta watch out. It, it turns out it is, in fact, a small world after all! I'm gonna wait for this to finish, because I... Aesthetically, I don't understand why they decided to do this. Like, it's okay as an idea, but it just looks weird. 48 hours! 
it's fine. That sign kind of bounced. All right, it's daytime, which means uh, not much has changed. Uh, she did not come back out, turns out. I thought she might have done, but she did not, in fact, done. Hmm. I'm a little perplexed. Let me try going in here. <laughs> So I soared away and came back. Is this gonna do what I want? The small child is still not here. Do I have to reset time? How does I get the time? Words, help. I'm bad at them. So I looked this up. Apparently I can do one of two things. Uh, I can wait outside for two minutes. Or I can throw a bomb near her house. Ow. I said, throw a bomb. Well, you know what? It's fine. Don't worry. I didn't get blown up over here. I'm very unnoticeable. Don't notice me. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Let's go in the house now. Oh, this, is, this is a nice place. I love it. It's great. It's my favorite place in the world. There's a closet over here. Ah! I'm unnoticeable. You can't notice me. I am not noticeable. No, don't! It's me, Pamela! <laughs> Forget everything you've seen here and get out! What have I been doing the past, like, 20 minutes? Why do I feel like bombing this door again? <laughs> I don't understand. Everything in this world is just confusing. Why does this work, <laughs> by the way? I don't understand, but you know what? It's fine. So clearly, that was not the solution, but I just wanted to see it, because, you know, lore reasons. The actual solution, as it turns out, is uh, we gotta get this guy out of the closet again. Ah, but this time, I'm feeling some healing. This whole time. You haven't been doing anything! You had a bad dream! You're just having a little nightmare! You were turned into a mummy! I mean, you were having a bad dream! Oh, hey, a mask. That's weird. That's never happened before. <laughs> Yo, I got the Gibdo mask! It was once the hideous face of Pamela's father. It looks so real that even a Gibdo would mistake you as one of its own. It seems awful convenient in Mummy Town. Listen, I'll be as insensitive as I want. I'm a video game protagonist. I'll do as I wish, you stupid ball of light. Anyway, I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> All right. Now that we got the Gibdo mask, next time we've got some shenanigans to do further in this dark and scary place uh, during the daytime, apparently. It's almost noon. Yeah, but if you go up here, Tattle yells at you briefly. And, uh, 
empty well ghost sightings. That sounds like a hoot and a holler. So next time we're gonna have some hooting and hollering. Hope you enjoy. I'll see you later and goodbye.